excited. I am Betsy Lavoy with the Fountain Hills Chamber of Commerce here in, representing the board of directors and the staff to welcome the newest rendition of MCO Realty tonight with a ribbon cutting. You'll he'll hear lots more about that in just a moment. And we start every ribbon cutting with a proclamation of good fortune. And so we are going to start with the proclamation and we have Al Romano from Fountain Hills Healthy Heartbeats to present that. Thank you, Betsy. The proclamation. Whereas, from the traders and merchants who crossed over the transcontinental, oops, crossed over the McDowell Mountains on the transcontinental railway, to the merchants of today in the shadow of our famous fountain, progress and new beginnings have prevailed. Whereas, those new beginnings have marked the development of Fountain Hills as the hidden gem of the Phoenix Valley and the friendliest town in the nation. Thereby, we the ambassadors of the Fountain Hills Chamber of Commerce wish to congratulate MCO Realty on their official ribbon cutting dedication. We present this proclamation which carries with it 100 years of good fortune. Awesome. Thank you, Al. And then we are all going to count down together from five to one for Michael to cut the ribbon. So this is the moment we've all been waiting for. Five, four, three, two, one. Oh, <laughs> so awesome. And thank you to our ambassador committee and Al Romano for sharing that proclamation. We are going to bring up Mayor Dickey to join us. Thank you, Mayor. Come on up here. And along with Mayor Dickey from the, our town elected officials, we have Council Member Hannah Toth. We have Council Member Brenda Calavianakis. We have Jerry Friedel. I've tried to see in the sea of people. Look at the support you have. Look at this. This is amazing. And so, Mayor Dickey, thank you for presenting. Of course. Thank you. So, I know everybody says stuff about full circle. This is a full circle moment. So, we were just chatting. I was chatting with Mike and Lewis, and my parents bought in 1979. <laughs> they lived right there in clear air, MCO. I mean, and here we are starting a new. Uh, obviously, I've been here 40 years. You you went to the schools. Uh, we've just had a, a great talk the other day, and I'm so honored and pleased to be here. I don't know if you already have a fountain pin, but we have one for you. And if you both want to come up, we want to hear from you. And we're just so happy that you're here and your commitment to our town is as undying as ever. There you go. You hold this. I will. All right. That. Wow, how incredible, right? To, to carry on a tradition. Okay, can I hear, can we hear me? Well, you say I'm always loud. Am I, am I loud now? Okay. To, to carry on a tradition, right? I mean, all the agents and the people that have been affiliated with MCO building the town, um, selling billions of dollars in real estate, it's, it's humbling for us to continue this tradition that so many people have built. It's humbling. So, thank you. Thank you, Michael. So I wanted to share just a, just a statement. It, it'll take me just a, a few minutes just to um, uh, kind of expound on what Michael, you know, just stated. Um, you know, thank you guys for coming out. You know, the acquisition of um, MCO Realty is, is, has been a big undertaking, but it's going to um, kind of be the beginning of some changes that we have for ourselves, for the agents that have been so supportive of us. Um, as you guys know, the history of MCO runs deep in the Fountain Hills community. Um, you know, after the purchase of the area in the late 60s, you know, McCullough Properties took home one of the large, took on one of the largest land and cattle, um, uh, I'm sorry, took on one of the largest land and cattle empires in the state of Arizona and, you know, shaped it into a community that we love today, you know. Um, it, it's just fascinating how much the changes have, have been realized and, and how we can be here and uh, uh, enjoy what we, the community and the the connectivity that we have here. You know, today, MCO Realty is renowned for its dedication to excellence and commitment to its clients. And 
we welcome this new era with open arms. Um, our team is dedicated to providing the service that we have been providing for many years, excellence, uh, caring, um, professionalism. And we want to take on in a leadership role some uh, connections um, and really just build some relationships with the agents that are here and some new agents to continue to provide the community with that great service. Um, so I joined this team because my friend, Michael Gant, now my friend uh, for eight years, now my business partner, as well as uh, our friends over at MGM Holdings LLC have really wanted to preserve the sense of community and they've had an insatiable desire to make sure MCO remains a pillar of the community. And while we're here, there's some agents that are new. There's some agents that have been here for some time. Um, I see some agents here in the crowd that have really helped develop MCO Realty. Um, there are, uh, Carol Goyana, S Susan Dawson. Um, yep, clap. Uh, Patricia Kinney. You know, we have uh, Zintars Grouds, uh, Melinda Stanton, Lynn Smith. Uh, among many others that have been here along the way. Um, we just want to remind people that we have a commitment uh, to the community and that it will go beyond the transactions that our clients experience. So, you know, in closing, I do want to uh, thank Fountain Hills Chamber for their commitment to community, their commitment to business, their commitment to families. Um, that's That's been a huge part of, I think, what makes this community great. Um, I'd also like to share um, uh, a special thanks for our marketing partners, uh, Sherry and Carrie over at Grand Canyon Title, as well as Mike Cook um, and Rachel Tarman of Upland, powered by VIP Mortgage. Um, lastly, I'd really like to thank um, uh, my other half, Donna Smith. I, I feel like I've been here out in Fountain Hills and in this building for 14 hours a day for the last three months, you know, as well as Melissa Gant. Um, you know, so I, I just want to say thank you and um, thank everybody for being part of this wonderful and momentous occasion for us. Thank you. Huge congratulations to the two of you and our community. And I know that um, to speak to what the mayor started to share about the nostalgia of it, I hope it's okay that I'm sharing this, but the uh, you can reach MCO at 480-837-2500. And how I know that phone number is because my mom worked here. And as a kid, I would constantly call that phone number and it has been burned into my brain all these years. And so it's just, it really is a full circle moment. And the fact that you are continuing the legacy of Fountain Hills with agents like Kelly Smith and the agents you mentioned is just awesome. So we are they're so thankful you kept it local, you kept it in Fountain Hills, and we wish you huge success. Oh, the Diamondbacks won. Everybody, please stay. Join us. There's more drinks. There's more food. Please hang out if you have time. Thank you very much. Thank you. Good job.